Washington Prep. Frederica Wilson DFLA predicted that President Donald Trump will eventually resign from office to avoid impeachment by making up an excuse such as somebody is trying to kill Baron Trump, his 11-year-old son, we just have to, like the slogan says, stay woke just stay woke, be careful, because I can see the wheels turning now, we're marching toward impeachment, there's no question about it. If that happens, are we prepared because it's going to happen? Wilson said Thursday at the annual legislative policy conference organized by Al Sharpton's National Action Network NAN on Capitol Hill. So we have to make sure, Rev. Sharpton, that we are prepared when this happens so we don't just wake up one day blindsided, she added. I think it's just going to get so tight and it's going to close in and then everybody is going to be indicted around this president, and then he is going to realize he is probably next on the list. And I think he is going to come up with an excuse like somebody is trying to kill Barron, and so I'm going to resign. Wilson went public last month with her account of Trump's phone conversation with Myshia Johnson, the widow of Sergeant Le David Johnson, one of four U.S. soldiers recently killed in Niger. Wilson said Trump told Johnson that her husband knew what he signed up for. Myshia Johnson later confirmed this. Trump tweeted that Wilson's recollection of the conversation was a total lie. Wacky Congresswoman Wilson is the gift that keeps on giving for the Republican Party, a disaster for Dems. You watch her in action vote our Trump tweeted. Wilson, who has reported receiving death threats, said she has received a lot of support from the Democratic Party and military families during the backhand fifth with Trump. I've never experienced anything like this in my life, and I couldn't understand why this gentleman would just pick me out of the crowd and try to assassinate my character. I said, he doesn't know me, because I'm not the one to pick on and stand up and try to pick the fight with. And so, it's been a continuous thing, Wilson said at the NAN conference. I want you to know I've had such support from the Democratic caucus, she added. I went to the meeting yesterday and when I walked in the meeting the whole Democratic caucus stood up. While I was at home, they had almost like a rally on the steps of the Congress. In her speech, Wilson also predicted that Trump would be indicted for financial crimes after he resigns, so I think H.E.S. going to resign from the presidency before he allows himself to be impeached. And I believe that the day he resigns and becomes a normal citizen, he will be indicted for income tax evasion and spend the rest of his life in prison just like Al Capone, she said.